Oh yes, it's Raiders Night and the feelings. Right, four copies of Raiders Night. Hi guys, it's Joe here from Rufio. Today we have an entire case of Phantom Rage to be open, courtesy of Jam Jam Cards UK. Of course, the channel sponsors. If you want to, go check out their link in the description for a nice little discount on probably some of these cards that I'll end up on the eBay store. Yeah, go ahead and check them out, get yourself a cheeky discount, but we're not going to waffle on for too much more. We're going to get stuck right in to opening this entire case of Phantom Rage. Box number one, let's go. Secrets. One, two, three. Three secret box. Off to a good start. Who knows? Might get really lucky and have a four. That makes up for the fact that they're not worth anything. <laughs> I mean, those are the two, the two of the better secrets. Okay, so box number one down, a nice free secret box. We're happy with that. So just doing a quick run through these. Apologies if you can't see them very well. Of course, I'm this side of the camera, so we're kind of doing some guesswork here. That's why I'd give you a quick run through of what was pulled in no particular order, of course. That's an ultra. Uh, that's an ultra. Clearly, I can't see. Long day at work. Um, four ultras, Raider's Wing, Fractal, Mutant M50, ST, 46 and then on ice three secrets not too bad at all let's go on to the next box Speak of the devil, 
you said you'd rather I pull your meow meows, that's what we did. Which says a lot. Ooh, I got you a uh, Zeus. So as we can see here, table getting nice and messy. Just gonna do a quick run through the supers. Uh, don't really know what I hope we pull here. I mean, the secret wasn't too bad. Again, apologies if you can't see everything on here. It's just not the best angle, but working with what I have available. We've got the Phantom Knights Ultra as well for the rank up. Another one of these things. And then our two secrets. This one, one lit boy, solid card, and then of course the fusion. Uh, Box number three, let's go. Is this called Jack in the Hand? Jack in the Hand. Oh, oh, beautiful. Jack in the Hand. Very appropriately named. and our secrets. I think this one's quite interesting actually. Might be one to keep an eye on.
got that with this. Oh! Oh, he pulled the heater! Is that it? <laughs> yeah. Yeah, boy. Let's fucking get it. Hey, Hedman, you told me not to pull this, so I pulled it for you. What's up? What's fucking up, boys? <laughs> Case paid. You happy? Yeah, man. We're happy. That doesn't go in the part that goes here. Oh, I've lost where I'm up to. <laughs> we stopped doing the case. We're <laughs> like, like, that's it, guys. Case opening over. You just start standing in the box. Okay, so we're looking through the values of this one. We don't really give a fuck about these, do we? I mean, just some supers, who cares? This box is actually insane value. So we've got the alpha, obviously a secret. We've got this piece of shit ultra we don't care about. Scale, fractal's not too bad. This is not too bad. This is quite cool. We haven't seen any of these yet, but the real fucking blessing here, let's fucking go, is this bad boy over here. Hopefully you can actually see that nicely enough on the camera. Like I say, working in a bit of a kind of weird setup here, but beautiful. Money's worth paid for the case on its own, boys. Can we get another Starlight? Not fucking happening. Better chance of Trump winning. Who knows, maybe if I just say that I pulled one enough that it'll just happen. Hmm? Oh, no, no, no. I said, oh, maybe I'll pull in another Starlight. I guess there's as much chance of Trump winning the election. Maybe if I just keep saying it's happened, it'll happen. I guess you deserve it now. I've also decided to move the stand a little bit because I want to be able to fucking glean on here. Milfies. <laughs> so you felt that was Swan with fucking collectors, wasn't it? Yeah. His missus found this a collector's BLS in his bulk. <laughs> Didn't realise it was there. What a fucking world. It, this sort of stuff does really desensitize you to the value of cards in a weird way, though, doesn't it? Yeah, it does. <clears throat> when you have access to whatever you want. Yeah, I mean, literally, like me at the moment, like, I'm like, why wouldn't you play this? I can just get it. Okay, so box done. These are our secrets and our ultras. I'm not going to show you the supers because we don't really care. We'll go through all that at the end. Uh, we got Wolverine. He doesn't really do anything. I'm considering using this though, just for a bit of damage pushing. Nice and easy to summon. This is quite an interesting one. This is garbage, but of course anime fans will love it. Fusion, and of course the scales, the important card in this one. And another box. It starts to lose its fun about halfway through, doesn't it? Yep. <laughs> All you can do is look at it and be like, money, money, money. Why do I have people? 
should do it for me now. Literally, I think the heat is going to carry me through like an extra couple of boxes. Just like, ah. I can't complain, it's free content. Just this and then a load of garbage supers that nobody really cares about. Tri Brigade, this thing that no one's ever going to play, and some Ultras. Another Fractal. Important card in that engine if you guys are looking to pick it up. That's not me. <laughs> Doing a switcheroo because I'm getting too fat and too tired and too old. So I'm going to have some fun and open some boxes. I've already pulled the Starlight, so that's all the fun done anyway. Supers we don't care about. In terms of the ultras, we got one Raiders Knight, one Evolution Lab, one Virtual World Phoenix Fan Fan, Mutants um, ST4640, even Secret Warning Point, and Secret. It's basically Microcosmos. Yeah. Microcosmos that Synchro. That one. Alright, go crazy. Box number eight. Watch the packs on this. As I've been discussing off camera. Oh, that Pre one that one was uh pretty sure some down. of these are mapped. Some of these are mapped. Avatar, one Armateel, one Fracas, Frack or whatever it's called, one Dogmatica, Secrets, another Macrocosmo, and a new one, Arc Rebellion XYZ Dragon. Yeah, let me just have a quick look at that real real quick. We haven't pulled this one yet. Yeah, 
boy. what you got. Don't care. One Brigand the Glory Dragon. One Raiders Knight. Another Brigand the Glory Dragon. Didn't realize oh, two, two of those in one pack. And a Ferret. Then for the secrets, Mutant Ultimus and a Scales. That's our third Scales this pack. Or this case. Hmm, not bad. We have one rank up magic, 105, one new Lulu, and a Phantasmal. We have a warning point and a macro cosmo. Very Shen Shen. I'm telling you, that's the cap shell of the box. Oh man. So we got Fan Fan, we got Mutant 05, we got a Ferret Boy, we got a Rank Up. That's not a boy, that's a girl. Is it a girl? Not that we're about assuming genders around here. It's a Ferret Boy. I don't care really, do I? One Macro Cosmo and one Dragon. I'm back for the last box. Let's get it. This is where we pull another starlight. Imagine. Mate, you pull another starlight. Imagine. I'll give you 50 quid if you pull a starlight. John Lennon singing. Imagine all the starlights. Oh, 
pulling all the starlights. Smell fees. These are weird looking flashlights. I just opened Alpha's every box, bro. Make this look easy. So secrets for this box, these two good boys, probably two of the better ones that you could pull. We'll just pull it like it's nobody's business. And then four ultras, uh, ones that nobody really gives a fuck about. These are good though. And now we're gonna go and take a look at what the entire case was. Okay, so here we have it, our pulls from this case. Obviously, we know that it's been a mixed bag as far as these things go. Um, one particular card has paid for the entire thing, which we'll get to in a moment. If you haven't seen it already, you're a bit of a weirdo for getting this far without watching properly. But we're going to go through the ratios for those of you who are interested in pull rates a little bit. Of course, we're not covering the commons because, well, this is the commons here. If you can see that on the edge of the camera, and uh, that might take a while. But we'll go through the supers, ultras, and secrets, and of course the one starlight okay so this isn't going to be perfect you're going to be able to see absolutely everything but you will be able to see roughly what card we're talking about again we're not a uh, high production quality around here so let's have a look shall we so we start off with raid raptor strangle lanius it's kind of kinky really uh one two three four five six seven eight copies of strangle lanius next up we got Mutant Arsenal, disgusting name, should have called it Mutant Tottenham. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten copies of Mutant Arsenal, disgusting. Now we're on to Long Long, stupid fucking name, I know. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven copies of Long Long. Next up we got the Joyous Milfies. Beautiful looking flashlights over here. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight copies of Joyous Milfies. And next up we got Infernoble Knight, Captain Oliver. Apparently quite good. I'll take Jam's word on it. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten copies of that. Not too bad at all, to be honest. Next up, one of the actual good supers to pull out of here, Meow Meow, uh, for people obviously, well I say Meow, it's Meow Meow Moo now, fucking stupid. Uh, if you guys are looking to pick up this deck, of course you'll be able to pick up on the eBay link, there'll be some of the cards on there. But if you're also looking to learn how to play the deck, including with this card, I've got some videos on that. Just go have a fucking look, will you? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine copies of that, a little bit shorter than some of the others, but again, we're talking averages here, so technically there's nothing short printed. Some more super goodness, some dual avatar fists Yuhi. It's like Yugi, but not good. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten copies of Yuhi. Some 
Seven copies of Mutant Mist. Gizmek Mikami the Ferocious Fanged Fucking Fortress thing. It's a Gizmek. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven copies. Do I fuck? Next up, we've got Virtual World Beast Juju. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten copies of Juju. Next up, we've got an Infernity card. These haven't been relevant in forever, so I, I don't really understand, but there you go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten copies of Infernity Doom. Archfiend. Dual Avatar feet. Feet. People will pay extra for this fucking card, you know? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Eight copies of uh, feet. Mutant Beast. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight copies of Mutant Beast. Now we got nyan 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 one, two, three, four, five, six, seven copies of Juche. Rock band Zenogatar, the only actual instrumentalist in this entire band by the looks of it, because I don't see any others. But there you go. One, two, three, four, five copies of Zenogatar. Tri Brigade Keras. If you're interested in learning how to play this deck, we will have a video coming up very, very soon probably next week at the time of this recording so yeah fuck it you'll work it out coming up soon on how to play this with a very basic line of combo and all that good stuff and of course if you're looking to pick up the deck some of these will be available on the ebay store one two three four five copies of keras virtual world roshi lao lao one two three four five six copies of lao lao Virtual World City Kwaoloon. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten copies. Conductor of Nepthys. Apparently, they're still releasing support for this for some reason. Uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine copies of Conductor of Nepthys. Okay, the feet are back, boys. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven copies of feet. Fusion feet. Fusion feet. Uh, we've got dual avatar fists, armored Goyo Guardian. One, two, three, four, five copies of the Goyo. Mutant Synthesis. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven copies of Synthesis. Yeah. Phantom Knight's Claw. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve copies of Phantom Knight's Claw. The Hyper Stadium UA. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten copies of UA Hyper Stadium. Perfect Sync. Ahun. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight copies of Perfect Sync Ahun. And next up, we're moving on to the Ultra Rares. Luckily, this won't take quite as fucking long. Raider's Wing. Three copies of Raider's Wing, if I don't drop them. Good thing they come damaged out of the packs, right? The new PK Rank Up Magic Force, four copies. 
four copies. Armour Tile, the Chaos Phantasm, Phantom of Fury. Fucking ridiculous. Imagine writing that on your deck list. Four copies of that bad boy for you casual fans out there. Tri Brigade Ferret the Baron Blossom. Is it a boy? Is it a girl? Do we care? Virtual World Phoenix Fan Fan. A nice five copies of that for you. Oh yes, it's Raiders Night and the feelings. Right, four copies of Raiders Night. Dual Avatar Empowered Congo. Three copies. Mutant Evolution Lab. Three copies. Bastard the Ash... Oh, fucking hell, I don't know, they're the same goddamn thing, aren't they? Brygran the Glory Dragon, he's like the other one, but not good. Mutant MO5, easily going to be confused with the other ones because nobody fucking cares. They look pretty much identical anyway, one's slightly darker than the other. We've got four copies of that one. Speaking of the other one, let's see how many we got of that. I think six by the looks of it. Yep, six copies of the other one that I can't be bothered to read the name of. Hopefully you can read it from there. If you can't, tough shit. Fractal, one of the actual good ones in here. Really, really important to the deck. You want to max out on your copies of these. Four copies in a case. Make of that what you will. We've got Wolverine, two copies. Two copies of Wolverine. We've got just a single copy in a case of Lulu. That's right, it's the same pull ratio as a Starlight. So if you want it, we'll do it to you for 150. I think that's a pretty fair price. Uh, and you can get 10% discount on that courtesy of me. So use my fucking link. Okay, now we're on to the good stuff. Well, well, depending on your opinion on the matter, of course, because some of these are straight trash, as you very well know. Uh, we are on to the secrets. The secrets. I pulled all the good ones. James didn't pull any of them. Uh, so we'll start off with the. Uh, in fact, we'll start off with this one that nobody cares about. Just a single copy of Dual Avatar Invitation. Again, if you're actually looking to pick up this deck, and these are uh, quite as hard to get as this. Again, just speculation because there's no short prints. But only one of these in the entire case. Of course, bigger sample size is needed. But just a single one of these in the case. Next up, we got Mutant Ultimus. Uh, three copies of that, a play set in the case, not bad at all. We've got the Macro Cosmos Synchro. Uh, this is actually an interesting one that I was looking at the other day. I think you guys should really have a look at this card. It could be a bit of a sleeper in the right kind of deck. But we've got five copies of that, a little bit of the cap shell of this one. In that it seems to be in every goddamn box. There you go. We got Warning Point. We got four copies of that in the case. Four copies of Warning Point. Okay, so we got a single copy of Arc Rebellion Xyz Dragon. No, I'm lying. Two copies. Two copies of Arc Rebellion. We got a single copy of Shireg. Shireg, the ominous omen. Single copy of Airborne Assault for the Tri Brigade, one of the important cards that you need in there. Secret rare, just a single one of those pulled in the case. On to our final three secrets here. We've got a single copy of Zeus. Single copy of Zeus, one of the most important cards in this set. One of the people are definitely going to be chasing. Definitely keep an eye out to pick these up soon enough. The new Pancratops guy, Alpha, does a bouncy thing. It's basically Pancratops, right? Three copies of that in there, three copies in the case. Okay, we're on to Torn Scales. One of the ones we actually seem to do okay on, I think four copies here by the looks of it. Four copies of Torn Scales in the case. If I could pull them apart, I'd show you. They're stuck together like I've nutted on them. Four copies of Scales. 
And then our final, final card. We're going to get a nice close-up of this for you now. Absolutely fucking beautiful. A single copy of Heater. Of course, don't plan this into your ratios. Not something you're going to be pulling in every case. I'm just damn lucky, I guess. But yeah, we'll uh, we'll finish off on that note. I'll give you a nice close-up before we go. Uh, if you have enjoyed the video and you made it this far, well done. You're an absolute fucking loser because this is going to be a long one. But thank you very much for staying along. If you haven't already, you should definitely hit subscribe. And I'll see you in the next one. This content is brought to you in association with my buddies over at Jam Jam Cards UK. You can find the links to the eBay store and the Facebook page in the description.